Good day everyone, I'm Mary Jean Arcelia Bisaiti, so taking up a Bachelor of Science in Information Technology. In this video, I'm going to present and discuss about how the network are connected to. We will try to work the network using apps, Cisco Packet Research Tool. So we have to click this one to create. So we have to put the switch in the center. The switch is belong to intermediary device. Switch is very smart. They can facilitate data from one another and knows all about it because they have a MAC addresses. Okay, let's put four desktop devices. So we have to rename switch 0 to switch 1. In this one, we have to change to Ali. And the... Uh, and also the three devices here we have to rename their names the last one is Doran okay we are done putting names by each devices so the next step we do is to make a way to communicate each other so we have to put a UTP cable here to communicate each other so Okay, let's go to the icon light like a uh, thunder. Then you have to choose the black one. Then go to switch. Then choose fast internet one. And then fast inter click fast internet. Then the second one is Bob. You must also to click the black one line. Then click to switch. Then choose fast internet two. Then click fast internet. Then the other. Third one is cut, click fast internet to, then click, then fast internet to, and the last one, the title is there, and you have to click the switch and choose fast internet for, then click, then click fast internet. And now, we are done putting the UTP cable. To communicate on each other, you have to put an IP addresses each of them. IP addresses is very important because if the IP addresses is not correct, they can never see each other and communicate. IP addresses is a unique addresses at all. So first, we have to put IP addresses to Ali. Then you have to click this tab, then IP configuration, then you have to type the IP address 192. 2.168.5.1 then the submit must is 255.255.255.0 the submit must is not as much as 255 because 255 is the limit number we move to bob so we have to Click the desktop, IP configuration, then IP addresses, then type again the 192.168.5.2 and then also the submit mask. Then the third one is cut. We have to go to desktop, IP configuration, then type 192.168.5.1. And then the subnet mask. So the third one is cut. So we have to put an IP configuration. So IP address is 192.168.3. And the subnet mask. Valid IP address entered. <coughs> the third one is cut. So we have to go to IP configurations. Then type the IP address. 192.168.5.3 then the submit mask then you have to close then the last one is darin you have to go to this tab again then api configurations then 192.168.5.4 then the submit mask then close in network IP config configuration, we must have 
to make it sure that the network addresses in the first to third column are the same to communicate each other except the last digit because they have their own unique addresses or the host Okay, we're done putting their own IP addresses. We have to try to send messages by one another. We have to click the icon messages here on the right side. And then click Ali to send message to cut. So we see in the lower side, so it's successful. And then again, we have to choose uh, Darren, then send message to Bob. So it's successful also. Then uh, last one, we have to click Bob, then send to Darren. So it's successful. The last one, we have to stimulate network using the simulation tool here on the lower corner. So we have so we have to click the auto capture play and then show all.